Uh, hi, everyone. Uh, my name is Min Li Zhang. I'm from uh, Amsin Lab and uh, with the supervisor, Alan Evans. Today, I will present uh, my work like uh, use uh, deep latent low rank linear and global structure for big brain super resolution. And uh, first, uh, uh, first, I will talk about the introduction. Uh, like uh, using uh, like image processing and the deep learning or machine learning uh, methods, we can reconstruct uh, highly detailed uh, structures for the big brain. Mm. Uh, which can may, maybe can like uh, serve a better reference for localizing high resolution multimodal measurements in a common space and build a basis to study the detailed uh, architecture of the brain model. Mm. And then we uh, we talk about the related works. Uh, this project is based on uh, like the low rank uh, representation and, and uh, deep latent low low rank fusion network and um, uh, our former high quality image restoration uh, approach. Uh, first, I will talk about latent low rank representation. It is like a decomposed the image into three components, uh, low rank components and the silence components. Um, also the space error. The low rank components is uh, uh, for extract uh, the details of the image and the silent components usually contain the energies of the ima image. And then E is the some space error. In mathematically, we can uh, present like uh, this and here, uh, X uh, usually is uh, the training data set. It uh, has uh, the D usually is the training data set, the uh, original subject is dimension, and uh, N is the numbers of the uh, sub uh, subject uh, examples we want to train. Um, like uh, here is the principal features and uh, X that, and uh, the LX is the silent features. Mm. Then I talk about the the advantage or disadvantage of this uh, approach. The low rank representation is a uh, very popular used. Uh, the advantage of the low rank representation is powerful for recovering and uh, classing subspace structures, and uh, it also is a uh, good to solve the like a limited sampling issue and. Uh, it uh, can obtain uh, enhanced performance uh, over the low rank representation. Mm. But uh, it's uh, uh, the, the issue is it's a single layer. It may contain some noisy and also it's maybe not that uh, effective to handling the complex state and uh, in single layer structures, it cannot uh, obtain the deep uh, higher article information. And so uh, with the, the former, with the, uh, so we here, we want to extend the latent low rank coding into a uh, multi-layer cases to learn the deep uh, higher hidden information and also uncover the deep low rank features and the class new structures embedded uh, in uh, latent uh, subspace. Also, uh, we want to consider uh, use a global structures by city as the space arrow for as a kind of regularization. Uh, then here we use the flow chart to show the different of the low rank representation and the deep uh, Latin the low rank representation. Uh, in the uh, general low rank uh, representation, it's used the, the 
first layers uh, matrix uh, uh, Z and uh, the silence features uh, the PX directory uh, to do classification or segmentation, uh, any kind of work. But here uh, we plan to use uh, also fusion the more deep information of the model. Like uh, we first uh, decompose the the features, the matrix uh, into the uh, shallow representation matrix Z and the PX, and then use uh, the former layers information fused with the current layers information to do classification. And here is the model how we uh, design the sparse arrow. And uh, we use uh, also another kind of gradient uh, uh, based uh, image. Uh, convolution. And then this is the flow chart of the, uh, the, the model. And uh, first we decompose the, uh, the input matrix into uh, three components. Since the arrow we want to uh, uh, do any kind in the deep uh, uh, flow chart. So we just show the two components, the uh, Confessions uh, components and the silence feature components. In each layer, we fuse the former layers, uh, principal features and the silence fe features to, to get the current layers, confessions and uh, the current layers project uh, matrix L. And then each layer we do the, this kind of work. We here in this work, I use the three layers. And uh, this is the flow chart of it. And the, then the model we applied into the big brain slice uh, uh, 2650 and the, the 20 microns uh, image. Since like uh, it's a challenge to do uh, image processing on some uh, uh, it's a challenging to do the image like with the texture or smooth the part. And here is the uh, some kind some result. The left is the original image after the five times zoom in, it couldn't uh, do any kind of zoom in. And then the right side is the uh, reconstructed uh, performance. So we can see after uh, image reconstruct uh, super resolution, we can see some detailed information of the big brain. Like here, we couldn't see in the 20 microns image, but after uh, super resolution, we can see more detailed uh, information of it. And this is some other example, like, uh, like uh, after resolution, we can see more clearly. And uh, here, and Also, like uh, uh, this is uh, some uh, uh, example. Um, and also, this is the final zoom in performance of the big brain. This is, I zoomed uh, uh, almost two times of it, of the super resolution image. Mm. And then, in summary, uh, we proposed a uh, deep latent uh, low rank representation model with the global structure specificity for big brain super resolution. And uh, the model reconstruct the principle and the silent features from the previous layers and the current layer. It uh, explores the hierarchical features by fueling the, pro the projective subspace and the uh, uh, subsists uh, in each layer. Um, the, uh, also, we evaluate the, the performance on uh, big brain super resolution. We can see more detailed uh, texture of the big brain. Uh, uh, we need in the future. We need to compare our method to state of the art uh, image super resolution approach. 
also uh, the sense for big brain uh, image super resolution, we don't have the ground truth. We can evaluate uh, uh, the performance with uh, some further image processing like uh, image uh, uh, segmentation or parcellation. And uh, this is my work. Thank you.